Hey guys, today we're PDAC, second day. We're here with Nicole Brewster from Renfort Resources. Nicole, we, we did a Zoom a few weeks ago, but anything new since then? What's going on with Renfort? Well, well, we're here, um, but we are just lining up all the pieces. The guys, uh, the drills will be moving March 15th to the western end of the Victoria Anomaly. So that's pretty exciting. That's the most exciting thing on the horizon. Looking at a few other things, I'm always kind of fishing around behind the scenes for what's next. Uh, had a couple interesting meetings looking at some uh, you know new technology that's out there that could apply to Whoa. our property in the future different ways to mine different ways to process so i'm looking further afield trying to come up with a way to accelerate things spending as little money as possible which is <laughs> always know? a good thing for investors yeah 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 so it's 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 but it's all going quite well it's all exciting and a lot of a lot of people see what this property is headed towards now well that's it that's it and being at an event like here are you attracting people? Or is, are people stopping by the booth and finally showing Surmo the interest it deserves? Yeah, I had an interesting uh, <laughs> major lithium company come by, and that's oh, wow. only on the potential of Surmo for lithium. But I've had a couple Australians stop by, a couple guys stop by hiding their badges. You know, it's getting, it's getting some eyeballs on it. So, well, that's great. That's Good exciting. For you. Good for investors. And one last question, Cole. So we're seeing a lot more people this year. Um, there seems to be a buzz around the mining sector. Can you validate that? What can you tell us? What can you tell viewers that are wondering, mm, is mining right for investing? Yeah, it's been an interesting year, actually. Um, last year was an anomaly. It was in June, where people like the weather better. But um, this year, if we go back to what PDAC was like right before COVID, because I was standing here as the world shut down. I was at PDAC as they shut everything down. Um, attendance is probably comparable. However, I'm actually seeing retail shareholders here. Oh, wow. They're coming into the booth, they're looking for me, and if I've stepped away, they come back, uh, which is fun because it's been a number of years since we've seen retail shareholders. Like pre-COVID, there were no retail shareholders coming to PDAC. Oh, wow. So I'm, I'm excited about that because that's a good indicator that retail is moving back into mining. And we need, we need that. I mean, I'm walking around with my uh, Love Canadian Mining shirt on, but uh, the back says the world needs more Canadian minerals, more Canadian resources. I would think and the government would tend to agree with that as well. It, you know, no time like the present, the world does need our resources and we're getting recognized for having a lot of those resources. And the world is walking around here, they're looking around. So yeah, there's, there's some neat energy. It's by no means a stampede, but it's very positive. Perfect. Well, Nicole, thank you very much. Thank Glad you. to see you. Wish yeah. you all the best and uh, have a good PDAC. Perfect. Thank you.